It looks like an ordinary offshore wind turbine. But according to its developers, it's not. It has been designed with a special telescopic technology that reportedly allows a faster, more efficient and cheaper installation in the marine environment. This prototype is already providing energy to 5,000 households here in Las Palmas, Gran Canaria. Just half an hour by boat from the island's main port, the offshore prototype took almost four years to become a reality. Its current power is five megawatts. What makes it unique though, is the way it was built and installed. Both the concrete base and the tower were constructed onshore. The platform was then towed by ordinary towing vessels for its final deployment at a depth of 30 meters. The foundation was then ballasted with seawater and the tower sections were telescoped. This prototype has two big systems. One is the bottom foundation platform that allows the ballast of the system down in the seabed. The other one is its auto-lifting system. This allows the tower to be telescopically raised and lifted into its final position. According to the developers, the installation costs were reduced by 35% compared to those needed by ordinary offshore windmills, for which foundations, tower, turbine and blades have to be assembled at the final location. Researchers say that maintenance works are standard. What are the main maintenance activities that the platform requires? Everything related to the technology itself, ordinary safety checks like inspections and monitoring of the general state of the facility. How hostile is the environment where the technology has to work? The marine environment is very demanding, but the technology is designed to withstand it. The structure was designed and built to be resilient. Designers say the whole system was conceived to be easily scaled up to the bigger, far more powerful turbines, up to 12 megawatts, which are about to enter the market. Whatever the size of the turbine, the stability of these offshore platforms is the main challenge. An offshore wind turbine is a nightmare in terms of stability. The turbine represents a heavy weight at the most elevated part. This raises the center of gravity and makes stability very difficult. This is why we opted for the telescopic tower. By taking down the turbine, we also take down all the loads, and this is a key feature to guarantee the stability of the whole structure during both transportation and installation. And along with further improving some of the technical configurations, researchers are now looking at the market opportunities ahead. We now have a number of options. We can first establish a demo site like the one in the Canary Islands, adding another three or five offshore wind turbines using the same technology. Alternatively, we could go for a bigger commercial park with 50 or 70 units. That said, the market for offshore technologies advances very slowly. We have to go step by step. Our current concept will probably indeed translate into commercial offshore wind parks that are operational, but probably not before 2024.